ready for a long trip to see. We've uh, figured out. We're trying to tell kids about the importance of clinical trials using the medium of the first clinical trial which was run by James Lind, Dr James Lind, a Scottish doctor who I am portraying with the helpful assistance of a team of HSRU sailors. 1747 was the first clinical trial, so quite a long time ago now and the, the mechanisms that were employed are employed again today. Our aim is to demystify clinical trials so when they, if they're ever approached for one, that they don't immediately recoil in horror and think, oh, I'm not doing that, because that does happen with about a third of people. And I think it was a great opportunity to use the Mayfest to come with children, school children, and show them a little bit of history, a little bit of science, a little bit of fun, no? yeah. of what we do yeah, normally definitely. in a regular day, so I think it's a great opportunity. It was a good team building experience, because Maga and I don't work together. Exactly. Uh, <laughs> except when we're running things like this. Yes, <laughs> so it's great. But... Yeah, definitely. No matter the age, it's challenging to make them understand what we are doing in a fun way, especially that they get engaged, that they get you know, attracted for what we do. So. I think always it's challenging, but yeah, I think it's, <laughs> we do um, our best. <laughs> as researchers and to some degree as experts, yeah. we've got a language that we use when we're explaining things amongst ourselves. Yeah. And one of the tricks of speaking to school children and indeed the wider public is being able to just say what we see more clearly to yeah. make it more understandable. Um, and that helps us as well make sure that we actually understand what it is we think we're talking about. We've recently won a major award, the Queen's Award, for the work and the contribution to um, health services research. Um, this is just part of the wider picture of, uh, of what the unit does in trying to improve health services research and communicate that improvement. It's important as a public body that we are seen to apply the research that we, we conduct so that people understand what it is that happens in a university.